Hi, my name is Chris Noble. I'm an independent IT consultant. My website is www.doglikehorse.com. I'm here to talk to you about basic computer network troubleshooting. The things you'll need for this are a basic understanding of TCP IP, the networking protocol, a computer, a network, and spare Ethernet cables. The first step when troubleshooting any network problems is to get back to basics. You'll need to check that you have power to your router or hub. So you'll need to make sure that the lights are flashing and that the green lights in particular are flashing. Read the instructions from your router or hub's manufacturer, which will tell you what different flashing lights mean. Typically red or amber lights mean there's a problem somewhere along that line. The next thing you'll need to do is to check the actual connections between computers. Often the simplest networking problems can be, or the hardest networking problems can be fixed by checking the cables and checking that the connections work. If you're finding that the problem to a network is just with one particular computer, try replacing the Ethernet cable to the router from that computer. Once you're confident that the computers are all connected to the network and the Ethernet cables are working and that you should be able to communicate between computers, the best way to check whether there's communication happening is to use a protocol called Ping. It's a tool called Ping. You can use that on a Mac or on a PC. On a PC, you just open up a command prompt, type CMD in the run box, and type PING space, and then the IP address of the computer you wish to ping. On a Mac, you just need to open a terminal window and type PING space and the IP address of the computer you're trying to connect to. If you can connect, there'll be a reply, and it'll typically be about 64 bytes of data you'll get back. If you can't connect, that window will tell you so, in which case you need to go back and figure out what's wrong with the hardware setup. My name is Chris Noble. Thanks for watching this video on basic troubleshooting for a network.